Lex Employee of the Year. This award is about recognising employees who go above and beyond to deliver their amazing work within institutions, organisations and the third sector. So the shortlisted finalists are, we have Chloe Carter at Be The Change, Callum Hutchinson at the Violence Reduction Unit in Glasgow and Anthony Jefferson at the Hep C Prison Team. And the winner is <laughs> Chloe Carter at Be The Change. Congratulations, Chloe. Thank you, Mary Claire. No problem at all, darling. How, can you give us a few words on, on how you feel and then I'll tell you some of the judges' feedback? Oh, it's amazing. I'm, I'm sorry that I haven't been able to be part of things today. I've had a bit of a personal emergency and that's why my video is not on. I'm in the car. But I'm really glad that I've made it for this part. Um, you know, just being part of, um, you know, the criminal justice system at this point, I think is, you know, feels like a privilege and it, it's, it, oh. Are you okay? Well, congratulations. Yeah, no, it's absolutely fine. Is there anything else you wanted to say, Chloe? Yeah, I just wanted to say thank you really to uh, Joshua Stunnell in particular, who is the Director. Oh, sorry, Chloe, you're cutting out, but I think you're saying that you want to. Just... Sorry, Chloe, you're cutting out. I think you're just thanking Josh, who's the CEO of Be the Change, for all the support he's given you. Um, I think, Chloe, if you put yourself. Can we mute? me all the time to continue to just be more and more ambitious for the Chloe. people that we work with. Um, <laughs> Sorry Chloe, we can't, we can't hear you darling. Gonna, um, brilliant. Sorry, Chloe, we can't hear you very well, but um, I just want to give you some feedback. The judges said that the reason they awarded you the winner is because uh, the feedback from your clients and also being a female role model in a system that is unbalanced towards men. That was the reason that they gave um, for voting you as the winner. And for the next uh, runner up prize is this is a difficult one with so many great shortlisted candidates, but we're going to award it to Callum Hutchinson at the Violence Reduction Unit in Glasgow. <laughs> Some happy faces up in Scotland there tonight. Is Callum here with us, Jerry? Yes, yes I'm up here. Eh? Hi, Callum. If you just mind giving us a little bit maybe about your journey and how this feels and, and anything else that you think is important. Yeah, it's amazing to even be shortlisted and um, my journey has been um, quite a whirlwind, to be honest. I've spent um, most of my, my teenage years in prison, when I was 16 till I was 21, in the system. And then um, four years ago, changed my life for a life-saving intervention by the VRU. And I've now worked my way up to be a senior development officer within that um, organisation, um, creating an open opportunity for people who are coming out of prison, in prison, and ex-offenders want to change their life. So I, I dedicate this to them um, because without them, I certainly wouldn't be where I am today as well. And, and I'll thank Jerry um, for putting me up for this nomination and, and everybody else. And I'll congratulate Chloe for winning it as well. Um, I'm very humbled to be here. Thank you. Oh, thanks, Callum. That's really kind. And it sounds like you more than deserved a nomination. So thanks for all the work that you do.